Eric Demick, and Demick has been doing a very good job on the boards for this New York Knicks team. Michael Ray Richardson batted away by Archibald, saved by Cartwright. Knicks, if they haven't gotten that break down the floor, have had a tough time getting the ball inside. Cartwright, perish on him. And the seventh player is able to hit. In fact, he is seventh in the league in three-pointers. Rebound, Cartwright. Cartwright is not known for his rebounding, really horse the boards on that one. Guys right there, <laughs> almost four seven-footers. Oh, they caught him asleep, Richardson. Anything but the side of the backboard. Gerald Henderson, the fastest man on the team, but Glenn comes away, break away to Cartwright. Cartwright, the campy. Fine play by Cartwright. Play more due to the injury to ML Carr. Four-point lead. It's going to be cut to two, though, as Cartwright's in. He will count. And McHale reaching in, committing the foul. Ed Holzman says we go to this guy like he's been in the league for years, showing you the confidence they have. A big seven-footer who weighs around 240 pounds, now trying to make a three-pointer out of it. Archibald committed the foul on that last move by Richardson, inbounding the ball. The Knicks, Cartwright, nice touch as he finds a hole. Look at the year. We're probably the best two new rebounds to come in the league. And interestingly enough, one of them was a guard and the other was a four. Right, trying to force it. And so what they're doing is they're not getting good shots. And Red Holzman, I'm sure, made that point very clear. There will be a goaltending call. Campy Russell will be awarded the two points. You can see Celtics are playing pretty tough defense, but all of a sudden, baseline Williams, Cartwright. There's that multiple shot. They haven't had very many of those. The ball comes off, and Cartwright just bowls his way in there and knocks Maxwell out of the way to get it back up and in. And then so it's cut to two. Chris Ford from the corner. Cartwright trying to follow. And the foul on Boston. That's on Harris. Is that they're not penetrating, and they're not getting moving without the ball. So they end up taking 20-foot jump shots. That is going to be a goaltending or a push-off. A push-off. Offensive foul, Maxwell. Let's see if we can pick it up right here as he makes the penetration move. Watch his left arm. Didn't look like he was shoving off on that one. The transition. Trying to come up with a steal as Maxwell. He hits the deck. Can't be Russell. The Knicks need a basket. And Cartwright has an open shot. The way Cedric Maxwell down this stretch has been effective. And for the game, he's 7 of 8 from the field. That's the reason he leads the NBA field goal percentage. And Bill Cartwright. Oh, well, that's what you got to do. He's five fouls on the, on the man that's guarding him. Parrish, go inside. Gets the ball. Parrish just stands there. He just goes up and muscles his way to the basket. He's like a first year man last year. That's a good point. Those are the kind of guys that coaches just kind of leave alone, right? Hard right hitting with two seconds left. And that's going to do it. 117. 118. As the Boston Celtics have won their ninth in a row. And men, I've enjoyed our first encounter this year at the NBA.